fully he's fully attacking here. Here he comes. Oh, big slide from Buemi as he comes through turn two. When he comes through the first sector split, we'll see what he's got. What 31.8. Nice clear the, track ahead of him. Look. Yeah, absolutely. In the first sector is the time to beat. There you can see it on the clock. Just as they come down towards this uh, bird's nest chicane. What's it going to be for Buemi? He's slightly up, ever so slightly. So this is a full power lap from Sebastian Buemi. Now into the bus stop. So interesting to hear. Really, no gear changes. Must be like driving a go kart again, an old direct yeah. drive car. To the brakes. Into turn 11. Whoa! Oh, it beautiful. Must have been close to the wall there. Spectacular stuff from Sebastian Buemi. Now let's see what he's got in this middle sector. That's where we think Nico Pross lost a bit of time. And uh, yes, indeed, oh, Buemi found a half a second. second in that middle sector. So things looking good for the Renault team, and this is going to be the quickest lap time we've seen around the streets of Beijing if Buemi can hook it up for the final two corners through turn 16, not even bothering to get close to the wall there. Bruno Senna ahead of him here, but he should be okay, should, should remain clear for the rest of this lap. So here comes Sebastian Buemi into the final corner. What sort of lap time are we going to see from the Renault driver? It's going to be a 1 minute 36, I think, if he's hooked up this final sector. It's a 36.991. Half a second.